SM mapping is a type of synchronization which takes place between the internal candidate profile and that internal user's employee profile. The mapping is configured in the candidate profile template. If an update is made to one record, meaning the internal candidate profile or the employee profile, this will automatically update the other record. And this is through a bi-directional sync. When creating SM mapping, you need to ensure that the fields that you're mapping have the same field type. For example, you must be mapping a text field in the candidate profile to a text field in the employee profile. Or for example, a picklist field to another picklist field. You must ensure that both fields are defined with the same picklist ID when SM mapping picklist fields. The required element of both fields should also match, meaning that in the candidate profile, if a field is required, well then the same field that you are SM mapping in the succession data model for the employee profile should also be required equals true. I'll open up Notepad just to show you an example of SM mapping. So here we can see that there is a field ID last name in the candidate profile and we're going to map the value from this field to another field called last name in the succession data model template, which is the employee profile. 